Welcome to Ghost Jive, an experience for the average observer or a dialogue for the paranormal connoisseur. I'm Chris. I'll be your guide today. Let's get. Ah! How did this happen? Happy Thursday, Internet! Today's featured ghost is one that many of our viewers have been writing in and asking that we cover. So today we bow to fan demand and bring you the succubus. Unfortunately, you all seem to have forgotten that ghosts don't show up on camera. Fortunately, I found a number of succubus images in my personal, professional collection. The succubus is traditionally considered a demon, but we don't discriminate here on Ghost Jive. The name comes from the Latin word strumpet, and the Latin word strumpet comes from the Latin verb to lie underneath, which is what strumpets do. Accordingly, the succubus is an erotic demon, one that takes the form of a human woman in order to seduce men into sexual intercourse, which explains the fan demand. Not all succubi are malevolent. It's said that the millennial pope, Sylvester II, achieved his high position through his involvement with a succubus named Meridiana. Hey, ooh, <laughs> like it when I say that name, huh, baby? Meridiana. <laughs> Meridiana. <laughs> ooh, hey, baby, baby, not now. I'm on camera. I, uh, uh, millennial pope, high position. Oh, but he confessed on his deathbed and is thus considered repentant. Now, the specimen we have here in the studio is a class... Well, I'm not really sure what class it is. It's definitely energetic, and a bit playful, even. Mmm. The smell brings to mind particularly high-class perfume. Not actually being human, succubi can manufacture their own pheromones and definitely know how to tweak the formula. Mm hmm Mm-hmm. Ooh. Okay. <laughs> All right. Okay. Okay. Hmm. Okay. That's... That's enough of that. That's not an altogether unpleasant experience. It's quite enjoyable, even. But that is the trap of the succubus. The pleasant experience has a distinct aftertaste of, of, well, of having my soul ripped from its physical form and used as fuel in some unfathomable infernal machine. Many amateur ghost hunters think they can resist the allure of the succubus. Well, many amateur ghost hunters are dead. It's important to remember that we here at Ghost Drive are professionals, and we would never... <laughs> okay, all right, okay, hang on, hang on. We're trained professionals and would never fall victim to... Okay, all right, take it slow. That was close. Let's move on to today's pairing pastry. It was supposed to be an eclair, but with how the dollar is doing, we couldn't afford to import eclairs from France, so we are using long johns instead. Hmm. 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 Yes, I can see. There's something missing from this pairing. The eclair adds nothing to the succubus. Either alone is great, and there's nothing really wrong with the pairing. It's just that the whole is exactly equal to the sum of its parts. That's good in math, but not so great in cuisine. It... Ooh. Hey, baby. Oh, you got your own eclair, I see. Well, if you care, you could probably fit that whole thing inside your... Mo oh. Oh, I see. Uh-huh. Yeah, like that. Uh-huh. Ooh. Yeah, that's nice. That's real nice. <laughs> well, we're all having fun. I've received a, uh, a note from our producer. This is a little embarrassing, actually. Uh, we have misidentified today's ghost. <laughs> Oops. Uh, they're mostly the same, though, so I'll just read off the differences before we uh, go. The uh, ghost is actually called an incubus. Uh, an incubus is a male demon that tries... A male demon that 